Yo, 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 how are you guys doing, man? It's Elijah again with a brand new video, man. And in today's video, guys, I'll be talking about when should you start using a do rag? Okay, let's get into the video, man. Welcome back. Now, for those that are new to my channel, I would love for your guys to subscribe, hit that bell notification button on for more videos like this. Okay. Ooh, my waves are fire. Shit. Fire. 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 Now, wait, hold on, man. Ooh. Ooh, look at that. Mmm. Mmm. I'm sure many of y'all are like, damn, dog, your waves, dog. Yeah, it's discipline. All right. Now, guys, in this video, I'll be telling you guys we need to start using a durag, okay? Because many people ask me, like, when I'm starting to wave, should I buy a durag as well? And I mostly tell them no, man, because you don't um, need a durag in the beginning stages, okay? You'll need a durag when you see that waves are forming in, okay, so that you can lay them down that's where you need a do-rag basically that's when you need a do-rag because many people think that you need a do-rag from the beginning um, of your journey which is wrong okay guys because you don't really need a do-rag from the beginning okay now I'll be telling you all this all right as a waiver as a beginner okay the first thing that you will need obviously is a brush okay a brush and um, and a moisturizer that you'll be using to keep your hair healthy and moist and all the time all right not a do-rag okay a do-rag should come into place when you've noticed that your hair got waves okay now how will you notice that your hair got waves let me tell you something all right when you are doing your washing style right and you realize that your hair is having waves forming okay and the connections are coming in now all right that's when to start using in a durag okay that's when you'll be using the durag now to lay down the waves okay because if you don't use a durag your hair will be sticking up okay now this is when you see progress when your waves are forming and this might take probably like within one month to two months okay from the start of your journey okay not in the beginning guys okay so from like one month to two months at, at least whereby there's some waves coming in that's when you'll start to be using the do-rag now okay to lay them down basically that's um when to start using the do-rag guys okay because you don't want to just be using the do-rag in the beginning stage when there's absolutely no waves in your hair i would recommend you guys that in the beginning you guys should work on your brushing sessions y'all should work on your angles to master your angles and stick to the same direction of your brushing patterns and forget about the do-rag yo forget about the do-rag yeah i'm talking to you beginner forget about the do-rag okay you'll only start using the do-rag when you realize that your waves are coming into place and your patterns are coming into place okay that's when you'll use the do-rag now to lay them down just like mine okay i use the do-rag to lay them down all right and they lay right i use a do-rag to lay them down simple as that guys okay basically that's that all right thank you so much for hopping onto my video i love you so much be cool stay wavy keep brushing discipline is the key remember that okay wave ain't easy man same as working out all right catching the next video stay cool all right